PS5 error code CE100005-6 is the type of system errors that appears when a data process fails. It is classified as low level that neither affects the functionality of the PS5 system nor other games or apps. That means if this error happens to you, don't worry about the other games or apps on your PS5, as it's not critical and won't pose any danger to the system. Here are all possible solutions you can implement in order to fix PS5 error code CE100005-6. Method 1. Restarting the PS5. When you have any issue with your PS5 system, the very first step you have to make is to restart the console. Restarting can resolve so many issues related to the system performance, so don't underestimate and overlook it. Method 2. Check the disk on another PS5. Let's find out what the real cause of PS5 error CE100005-6 is it the disk or the PS5 system. To verify that, you need to use the disk on another PS5 and check whether it works fine or not. If it does, then the PS5 system might have some corrupted or damaged files that must be repaired. Otherwise, if you find out that the disk itself is what causes the problem, try cleaning the game disk properly and gently by using an alcoholic wipe cloth or microfiber cloth. Make sure that there is no dirt, dust, scratch, moisture, fingerprint, etc. left on the disk. This can also help the system to read the disk properly. Method 3. Power cycle your PS5. Simply turn off the PS5 completely. Once turned off, disconnect the power cable from the console and even from the power source. Next, wait for around 5 minutes or so and then plug back the cable in. Finally, power on the PS5 and check whether the error code is fixed or not. If not fixed yet, try next method. Method 4. Download the particular game again. If PS5 error CE100005-6 occurs when you try to run a particular downloaded game, some game files might be corrupted or damaged which prevents the game from loading properly. What you have to do here is to re-download the game and try to install it again. For that to happen you need first to delete the game from your system. Make sure to take a backup of any important files related to that game, such as screenshots and game saves. Method 5. Update the game and PS5 system software. The game might have some incompatibility issues with the version of the PS5 system software you're using. If there's a new update for the game, go download it immediately and check whether it resolves the problem or not. Even PS5 system software updates can resolve this issue if it's concerning incompatibility. Therefore, don't delay downloading any newer updates for the PS5 system. Method 6. Factory Reset Your PS5. This is the last method. If you found out that the disk is working fine without any issue on another PS5, you will need now to factory reset the PS5. Note that factory reset will totally erase all data on your PS5 internal storage device. So make sure to take a backup of your important data before doing that process. In order to factory reset the PS5, you need first to enter the safe mode, and from there choose the option of factory reset the PS5.